What's up, my family? Listen, first time listener, or you've been here the whole damn time. Hit that like, hit that subscribe, giddy up. Let's go. Enjoy the clip. No notes. We have drafted the last five, seven years. There's zero chance of us being good in the next couple of years, in my opinion. Who's here in two years? Well, you, I, the only thing I do like is the two tackles, right? Our two bookends, I think, could be good in Dillard and um, uh, Malaga. So hopefully those two can stay good on the offensive line. And then you do have Devontae Smith on the outside. But besides that, offensively, Dallas Goddard, I mean, maybe. But I, I, I'm not going to say he's going to ever be a top 10 tight end. I, I don't see him being that. Um, I think tight ends are a dime a dozen also, just like running backs are nowadays. So I, I don't see anyone else on our offense being a, a future in two years. Defensively, there's no one. Nothing. Josh Sweat? Sweat is Sweat is Maybe. signed. So he's I mean, what else is there? Hargrave's twenty eight. So right. in two years he'll be thirty. You gotta think the decline's coming there. There's no linebackers. There's here. no linebackers here. The secondary's old. And, and not good. I mean, I don't know what Slay's contract is, but even having him, what's he going to be? 32? He'll you know? be older. Right. I think he's good. I think he's great. Don't get me wrong. Yeah. But, I mean, you look, your poll questions in two years. Yeah. You know, is Slay going to be here or is Slay going to be effective? I'm not sure. I'm really not. So, in the there's building, no safeties. I mean, are you counting Wallace? I, I can't. You can't count Wallace. It's, even Wallace stinks. Yeah. Um, but yeah, they're just kind of kicking the can down the road. That, that's what it's been, right? That's the Howie Roseman style. Miles Sanders. I'm not giving him a no, big contract. No. And then our scheme is just like not to use running backs at all, and they seem to like gain well a lot. He yeah, seems I, to get more and more touches every week. Every year, it's a new running back that we like a lot. So like, he's like the James White, Darren Sproles gadget kind of a running back right now maybe this this coach doesn't think he needs a an every down prototype running back seems like that's what he's using his gadget type of running backs i mean we all run the ball down you know between the tackles so what the hell's the difference of having one that does or doesn't yeah i like quez Watkins, but he's not a starter no he's a third fourth guy on a good team yeah like if you look at quez Watkins, if he's on the kansas city chiefs or the tampa bay buccaneers a premium t- offense right. in this league He's not seeing the field. He might not even be active. No, he and, and, and he's a guy who I'm okay with who might spell me for a game or two if someone's got a hamstring or something like that, but I, I can't rely on him for 19 or 16, 17 games. No. Davion Taylor at linebacker, he's a third-round pick. That's a joke. He's been getting more snaps. At least I see him. Yeah, he's been looking worse, play. though. But, I mean, that's the only slim possible guy that I can see here – in two years. And then the quarterback, I think we're both on the same page. Yeah, I think a lot of people. Everyone is now, the only, I think. The only, per, the only people who aren't, who are Jalen Hurts up as a franchise quarterback, are the people who just hated Carson so much. Well, you, you, and then you got the people who look at the, the, the newspaper, you know, the next day and, and see his fantasy stats, right? And he's lighting it up. The guy's getting 25, averaging 25 points on fantasy. That doesn't mean he's good, fellas. That does not mean he's good. He does not hit any passes. Yeah, I mean, if you're throwing the ball 45 times a game and you have the capability to run the ball like Jalen Hurts does, like he's our red zone. He's our red zone. He's running our back. offense. Yeah, he, he he's our is red our zone offense. running back. Yeah. So he's been getting at least one rushing touchdown in each of the games. I right, feel like, right. Uh, maybe outside of San Francisco, which he might have. I think he snuck one in actually. What Trey Lance? No, no, no. Oh. Uh, oh, Hurts, against San Fran. Okay, okay. But yeah. even then, I think he uh, rushed one in. So, I mean, your fantasy stats are going to look good if you're going to have one to two rushing touchdowns a game right. and have 45 pass attempts. But when you have six, seven to ten open passes that you completely miss, like that doesn't – you can't be an NFL quarterback. Like not even in the vicinity of – No, yeah, yeah. I mean, you're not leading your guy. You're You're not – you're not – throwing him open or whatever in that window that, that every NFL quarterback needs to hit, Jalen Hurts can't do it. So, and then he yeah. can't get the ball down the field, and he no. can't stretch the middle of the field. So uh, I don't know what people are saying, that Jalen Hurts is some franchise quarterback.